Okay, it's Monday morning, 7.22 at 11.30. We sold most of our positions. Instead of having an NVIDIA put now, we have NVIDIA call. We have one NVIDIA call for 125. We got our eight $17 calls for Rivian, and we got our two calls for Tesla, the 270 and 272. Tesla and Chipotle have their earnings this week. I did manage to buy a Chipotle call. We got a call for 5440 for this week. Now we just wait and see what happens during this week. We got our Nvidia call. We got a Chipotle call. We got our Rivian calls multiple and we got our Tesla calls. I will do an update video probably Wednesday and Friday. It's almost 9 p.m. Like, I'm not selling any of my stock today, so I wasn't really paying attention. Tesla has their earnings tomorrow, Tuesday, the 7.23, after market close. Chipotle has their earnings 7.24, Wednesday, after market close. So, I won't be selling anything until, like, Thursday or Friday. But Tesla went up today, made us some money. Rivian went up today, made us some money. Chipotle went up today, made us some money. And Nvidia went up today, made us some money. I hope y'all trades are going good too. This week seems to be a call week for me. Okay, it's 5 p.m. on 7.23. We lost a bit of money today, but not that bad to be honest. Chipotle went down a little bit. Tesla went down a little bit because they have their earnings call today. Rivian still went up, so slay. Eh, NVIDIA's going sideways. I'm sure it will keep going up. NVIDIA's got some insane buying power. I'd probably tear do. Oh, nice. Okay, so Palantir went up. That's good. That's good. I don't own any Palantir. I sold all of my Palantir. Um, they have their earnings next week, right? August 5th, one, two weeks, so two more weeks. <clears throat> to be honest, I might buy a Palantir. Buy two $30 calls. I might do that tomorrow. We shall see. We leave it open, so I remember, for August 9th, too. Okay. Now we get ready for this. We'll record more tomorrow, but now we're just waiting for the earnings call. I'll do a little summary of it, too, because I'm going to listen to it. Okay, well, the Tesla earnings came out already, yeah, because they come out at 4.30. And they missed EPS by 10 cents. Oof. Oof, that's a whole 16%. But, I mean, their revenue went up. I need, like, their full earnings report. The stock was down 1% after hours. That's not that bad. The 4%, that's where we get killed. Why you gotta miss your EPS and stuff, man? See, we should have just sold them yesterday. That's just the truth. That's what most people do. They sell. 
before earnings. Net income declined, bro. They are doing more energy generation now. Oh no, man. They definitely want good results, that's for sure. And it's all going to be dependent on what they say in this meeting. If they give us any forward guidance, if this goes right back up or stays down. TLDR for the meeting. Elon wants to focus on the automatons, Optimus, get those robots rolling out and working in Tesla facilities and then for use with the public. People wanted him to talk more about the Cybertruck and why he delayed that. He just says it was for an optimization. We didn't really get much forward guidance, just well, Tesla will always make good stuff, like always, and he didn't want to say too much because if he does, then it can impact current sales. I don't know, man. Tesla just, like, our, me as an investor, I want to know more about their current plans for the next month or two, and that's just because I'm a short-term investor. I know most people are long-term investors. So he's saying we'll have robots by next year, but legitimately he says everyone wants a robot. So that's 8 billion right there. I don't. So you can take that one off. I don't want a robot in my house. No, thank you. Do y'all?